Please watch this video and familiarize yourself with instructions before attempting to mold your Snorri's oral device. Before molding your Snorri's oral device, make sure you have everything needed for the fitting process. In the Snorri's oral device box, there should be an oral device case with your new oral device inside and an instruction leaflet. You also need a measuring bowl or jug, a kettle or pan to boil water in, a mirror, a timer and access to a cold water tap. We recommend running your oral device under cold water before starting the moulding process. Turn the screws on either side of the oral device clockwise until they are fully screwed in. It's important not to screw them in too tightly or you'll struggle to adjust your oral device later on. Make sure the screws lie flat in line with the strap and the adjustment block, like this. Make sure you have the oral device the right way up. Practice putting it in your mouth and removing it until you are used to it. You can look in a mirror to help you place the oral device centrally on your teeth. The bottom tray of the oral device is the one with the adjustment blocks and spacers on. Now that you have everything ready, it's time to mold your Snorri's oral device. Fill a bowl with 100ml of cold tap water, then add 400ml of boiling water. There should be 500ml of water in the bowl altogether. With the oral device fully flat with the blocks and screws underneath, place the oral device in the water, completely immersing the oral device to soften for 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Remove the oral device from the bowl or jug using a fork. Place the oral device in your mouth. You can use a mirror to check the oral device is in the correct position. Ensuring your teeth are within the channels, bite down for two minutes to allow the soft plastic to mold to your teeth. Use your fingers to press the oral device against your teeth, as this will ensure a better fit. Carefully remove the oral device from your mouth and immediately place it under cold running water for 30 seconds to set the molding. Place the oral device in your mouth and check it fits securely and sits centrally on your teeth. It's important to remember that the moulding process can be repeated up to three times if you are not satisfied with the results of your moulding. Once you are happy with the fit of your oral device, you can use nail scissors to trim any white plastic that spilled out of the tray. Wear your oral device in this position with the screws fully screwed in for the first few nights. If your snoring or sleep apnea problem is reduced, you can continue to wear the device in this position. If your snoring or sleep apnea problem persists, you need to move on to the next section of this video and learn how to adjust your oral device.